This is Satya Pradyuman of Cirrus Research. The latest issue of the Risk Metrics Report is just out. The title, Easing Central Banks and Benign Risk Appetites, Point to Durable 24 Markets. Uh, at the heart of this is that what's interesting in this window is that we are starting to see risk appetites settle. In other words, they have been weakening or slowing, and they've finally begun to rebound. The implication of this is actually a constructive equity market. If you look at our, uh, as we call it, the bubble chart, this is a look at key regions in terms of their markets measured by risk aversion and also by crowding. So in other words, if you're in the lower left-hand quadrant of this uh, chart, what that says is risk appetites are low and there's low risk of crowding. When you're in the upper right quadrant, this is a very, you know, really euphoric environment and a very crowded marketplace. And so what we're witnessing right now is very unique, the sense that most of these markets are sort of on their heels in terms of risk aversion. I think this is good in terms of looking forward. The idea that when market, when these readings are euphoric, that is typically your lowest expected return zone. The fact that these numbers are now below average, or in some cases especially weak, says that the market's somewhat defensive to very defensive. Now, in the U.S. is a special case because risk appetites were low. They've begun to rebound, uh, but they're not excessive. So what is important is, unlike most other markets, the U.S. is actually crowded. So, you know, the, the NVIDIA trade runs really strong in the States. That said, when we put this in perspective, globally, the profit cycle is bottoming. And so the fact that risk measures, risk, risk aversion is low, I think this is a very constructive outlook for equities. If you take this a little further, if we look at some key markets, the U.S., Japan, Europe. What's important is that we've started to see these markets work better, and the tendency is to sort of back away. But what the risk appetite measure says is that there's probably room for this to go further. So um, take a look at the full report. I think it's super interesting. And like I said, it's kind of unusual to see these readings like the way they are right now. Um, and as always, uh, very happy to take your questions. Thank you.